All right, in this video, I want to talk about something that I saw a glitch in on uploading videos to YouTube. You can have all the tools in the world of software to be able to help you out to, uh, to be able to utilize them to get your videos um, to rank higher on YouTube and all. Now, when you get, sometimes when you get two programs, that's supposed to do pretty much the same thing on the same site. Sometimes they will have a conflict if you have both of them, both of them running at the same time, which is common. So the glitch that I have found is the vid IQ has a conflict with TubeBuddy. Now I have reached out to TubeBuddy themselves and they have responded and they have confirmed that they have other people saying the exact same thing. I looked and see if I can find a workaround on this issue. And the only thing I can find is to disable vidIQ when you are actually uploading. Now, of course, the issue that I was having is when you have TubeBuddy installed and it automatically gives you should suggested tags to install into your video. They show up and it has the little green plus sign beside each one and you're supposed to be able to click on the little plus sign of the each tag that it suggests for you to use or suggestions that is relevant to your video. When you click on the little plus sign, it did not actually put it in the uh, section where the tag supposed to be. You just click on it. It did nothing. And I started thinking about, I like, okay, why is it doing this? So I put it in a different browser and all, and it still did the same thing. I tried, what is it? Indiglo, I do believe it's called. Um, yes, um, I tried it in that browse, you know, that section as well, and still the same thing. But since I mess with computers and I have my own computer store, I noticed like antivirus programs. If you have two in the system doing supposed to be doing basically the same thing, monitoring a certain location on your computer for viruses, sometimes they have a conflict. I've seen it so many times when I owned and ran a computer store. So I was thinking, okay, the vidIQ and TubeBuddy in this particular location, both of them are supposed to be giving you suggestion on tags to use. I said, okay. And all this is, is programs doing the same thing. Maybe there's a conflict. So I turned off vidIQ in the browser. Then I refreshed it. And then the TubeBuddy suggestive tags actually worked. Now, if I did not refresh the page, it still would not work. Let me show you what I'm talking about. You may have been having this problem as well. And this has um, been noticed to you, uh, TubeBuddy themselves. So I was not the only one. But this is the way I figured a way to get around it. Let me show you. All right, now here I am on my main page and I'm gonna to go to where you can actually upload. And I'm gonna choose a video. As you can see here, vidIQ is still actually activated. So I'm going to find something to actually upload. Let's see where I can go. Let's see if I got anything in here somewhere. I know I got something. 
I'm just going to upload some video clip that I actually have here. I have no idea what that is, but I'm going to upload it now. Go down here. Let's see. I'm just going to put something in there. And you can see that vidIQ is actually trying to give me suggestions. So I'm going to choose one. Now here is TubeBuddy giving related tags that you should consider adding that is you know if relevant so I'm going to try to add one click 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 nothing click 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 and as you can see add tag and I click on it I get nothing now I'm going to go up here and I'm going to manage and I'm going to turn this off Go back here and I will refresh this. Let's see. I'm gonna have to, if I refresh it, it's not gonna be able to finish upload, but I'll just do it again. Reload. I'll just go in there and delete these two videos after I get done, but I'm gonna upload the exact same one again. I'm gonna put in the exact same tag. And as you can see, that TubeBuddy is suggesting right here, but vidIQ is not. Now I'm gonna go down here and I'm just gonna randomly pick one. I'm gonna put this right here. And as you can see now, since I do not have vidIQ actually activated, I can put tags in all day long until I max out the 500 that you get right here. You just click on whichever one you want and it will actually put it in. Now I come up here and uh, let's see, manage, go to extensions. Let's see if I turn it back on and see actually what will happen. If I go to, let's see, where is it? Uh, VidIQ, here we go. Now it's turned back on. Will it actually interfere or not? Seems like as long as it's not on when you start your upload, seems like it's going to work, but it, it's not showing anything for vidIQ. So it's not completely fully engaged, active on your upload. So if you have problems with the new feature that you, uh, TubeBuddy has of giving you suggested uh, tags related that you should consider and they're not actually going in when you click on them and if you have vidIQ disable it and close your browser and re reopen it sometimes if you re uh, refresh the page sometimes that works but not every time so close the page reopen it or deactivate it and then close it and then go do your upload. I don't know if this has a conflict for everybody that is using Chrome, but I thought maybe I didn't have the latest, but I went and checked the update and it said it had the latest. So the only thing I found was these two features from two different programs that's doing the same thing has a conflict. Hopefully this, if you're having this problem, hopefully this solves your problem. Um, I, like I said, I did reach out to TubeBuddy and they got back with me in email and they confirmed that other people having the same problem. So if you have vidIQ and TubeBuddy that is suggesting you to put in these tags if they are relevant to your video and for some reason... TubeBuddy is not working. Disable vidIQ from the browser extension and then close the browser, open the browser, then upload and see if your TubeBuddy suggested tags it actually starts to work. Hopefully this helps you out in one way or another if you're having this problem. And 
If I see any more glitches or anything like that in any of the software that I use, I'll reach out to the company and see if they have any solutions, if anybody else is having them. If, um, if not, I will just try to figure out what the problem is on my own as I did on this one before I reached out. And if I can figure out what's going on and a solution to fix the problem, even if it's just temporary, just like this, I will make a video of it and share it with you. If you like these kind of tips, let me know by giving me a thumbs up. And if you want to be notified every time I go live or upload content like this, consider hit that subscribe button and hitting that little bell button down there. So YouTube will send you a notification each time I upload or go live here on this channel. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Take care.